wasn't moving with passion They wasn't moving with love All that fake is a dub Only do manga and subs They wasn't moving authentic Gotta get it how you live it All that fake is a dub Only do manga and subs Alright y'all, welcome to Manga and Subs Alright, we mm -hmm. got a whole lot of new content We got a new show where That's we're gonna be talking about everything Anime related, manga, manga related As far as news uh chapter reviews facts episode recaps what if scenarios what if scenarios all of that a whole bunch of things all right but we starting this one off we starting this one off with the fire all right so i don't know if y'all been watching but solo leveling oh, season one episode 12 is out uh i think this is the finale of the season correct correct it is and then what a season it was honestly and you know full circle uh we watch our son uh son jin woo Sun Jin Woo. We watched my son Sun Jin Woo rise from E rank dirt from the mm -hmm. bottom. Started from the bottom. Now he here. The weakest hunter in the world. Yeah. And like literally. Like, could you imagine if that was your shit? Like, oh, this nigga's weak. Like, that's your whole bag. Like, I would have rather not awakened. No, nah, facts. Everybody in New York City knows <laughs> you as the weakest nigga in the world. Like, nah, that's the weakest nigga in the world. We safe. Whenever he pulls up, it's like, yo, we good. Like, you know, this is about to be easy. Oh, they slapping your neck, taking your rune stones. Oh my god. Oh man. Yeah, yeah. But um, throughout the course of twelve episodes, we managed to watch Sun Jin Woo go through some extraordinary shit. Mm -hmm. Um, from that first double dungeon that he mm -hmm. went inside of and um, was left for dead, honestly, mm -hmm. by the Yo, people. Yo, spoiler inside. alert if you ain't watch it, but also. Oh, we should have said that, right? You know. Yeah. Spoiler alert for yeah. Because we're talking about everything. Yeah, go watch right? that shit. Go watch that uh, show. Great season of the show. You know, the show starts with the world's weakest hunter doing these dungeon raids, and they run into a secret double dungeon. And it just goes left, yo. Like, yeah, I, I'm not going to front. Left. Like, I'm not going to front. Everybody would have died if I was in that dungeon. What? OD. Espe especially if I'm Sun Jin Woo, like, and I managed to make it out. I want revenge. Oh, yeah, no, I would have killed everybody. Uh, yeah, I want revenge. Y'all left me. So, yeah, my man has a... A weird second awakening that's not technically a second awakening. Uh, he's out doing missions, raising money to help his sick mom. And he's basically just leveling up by himself. Solo, Solo leveling. Solo leveling. Yep. Um, what do you... Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, I thought the finale was great. Um, mm. I liked the, I guess, the extra tension they added to after the fight with um, Igris was done. Mm. It was like, oh, it's not over yet. Mm. You got to survive for however long you can survive for. Mm. And we got this endless mm -hmm. horde of knights, and you just got to survive. Like, that shit was crazy. I didn't know how my son was going to get out of that. So that was, like, one of my favorite aspects of, like, the season finale. Him going through that, going through, you know, the motions of self-doubt, starting to doubt himself because it's like, damn, like, I can't get out of here. Mm. No resurrection stone um, and no mana. I'm fatigued beyond I've ever been fatigued before. It's over. Like, I'm about to die. To the point where, like, oh, I'm seeing vestiges of my old self telling me I ain't shit. Like, nigga, mm. you bugging. You, you, why you come down here? Like, da, da, da. So I was, like, watching my son's growth, mm. like, full circle from the beginning of the show in the double dungeon to now. After that, it was just like, oh, fire. I think that other version of him, I feel like that wasn't actually him i feel like that was part of the system no nah, i feel like that's something else that is aware that there is a system okay because the way this shit was like oh okay clearly the system doesn't want you to die yet oh at the very end before he left yeah because i'm not gonna front i fuck with my son i fuck with my son jen Wu, but like my man's plot armor be going crazy he does you was not supposed to be egress what's his name though the, the 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 red bloodshed yeah, whatever the, the fuck the is blood there. red Igris the blood red oh yeah you was not Night supposed commander. to you wasn't supposed to beat that dude like that and I like that he admitted oh no I won by luck but you be winning a lot of your fights by luck and pure determination but it's like <clears throat> they said you don't get strong how's your determination helping you fight these magic animals see I'm, another I'm thing I feel like you, they but... need to put like more emphasis on in the anime is like the gear and the equipment and shit he be getting because mm. like I, after like watching. I guess episode 11 over because I was wondering, like what how the fuck did he just grab the blade like that he wasn't doing that before but it's like oh that was part of like I guess the special ability of the gauntlets was like and it was only a second but it was like oh the special ability of the gauntlets is your hands never get injured so that's how he's able to like stop in episode 12 when he's getting like hit by the swords mm. but he's not like taking any damage it's because his hands don't get injured because he got those invisible like gauntlets on 
Mm. But it's like, oh, that I feel like that detail should have been like a little highlighted more because I felt like him stopping Igris Blade in the middle of the shit was just like, oh, where the fuck did that come from? Am I oh, bugging on shit. that one? Because oh, it looks that. like it looks crazy, but like going back rewatching the episode, mm. you see like when he gets the armor, he talks about it like, oh shit. Oh, my hands never get injured when I put these gloves on. And then it's like, oh, the shit's invisible. Or I can still move mm. and shit. But it's like, oh, okay, that's how he wound up grabbing the blade. Even though it was a much stronger opponent, mm. he didn't get hurt. And that gave him the window mm. to, like, sneak him, honestly. He honestly snuck my son, Igris. Igris was really looking like a boss in there. I ain't even going front. So but that was a good fight, man. That was a, it was a really good fight. Um, I think they should put a little bit more emphasis on, like, the armor and shit if it's going to have mm. all of those effects and whatnot. Now, I feel like the armor has to be invisible because of how his character operates in the system and in the world where it's like, oh, you're the only person who's technically a player and mm -hmm. what's going on here. So you wouldn't have the armor that everybody else has because technically everybody will wonder how the hell yeah. did you get this armor you get you're that the from? weakest person here. Yeah, I get that. I get that. Plus the mobility issue or the like, mm. oh, it doesn't affect his agility at all. So that's good. Nah, uh, so it's lit. Uh, I'm definitely hyped for season two. I don't. I think this is one of those shows that I, I don't even. I don't feel the need to read it. Like I think I just like watching this. Yeah, one. yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Um, and it has like three different versions too. It's like a, a light novel, then it's the manga, and then it's uh, I guess the anime. So mm -hmm. I guess it's three different mediums. This shit mm -hmm. is already in. The story's over. If you want to go read it, it's mm -hmm. online. You could go read the whole shit. Um, but yeah, I would much rather watch. What's now going it's lit. On. I'm really interested to see what's going on in that island with the ants evolving. Uh yeah, well they like gnats now. They got wings. Homie in the other country, he who got his brother got killed. He's like when he get free time, he's pulling up. So I'm he's like, supposed okay, to be S, S tier. He'll be one of the what like two or three. I think we've only seen like three S tier people so far. The shorty nigga with the red hair and like the lion dude. Well, it was the other dude, but he retired. The one that was like oh the yeah, yeah you're healer right. from like the first right, episode. Right, right. Um, so it's not that many S rank people running around. So you know. That's something Ain't going to look to forward be that to. My son Jim, my son Jim, Woo, like he only like level forty seven right now. Uh, he don't need those problems. My son uh, really grind this episode, like yeah. But he got his necromancer powers. That's lit. So I'm interested to see how you know he controls the shadow army. I'm I want to see how he keeps that under wraps. I for like the, rest of the fights. I like his initial mm -hmm. reaction to being prompted. Like oh, I don't one. I don't get to choose my class. They're gonna analyze. They're gonna do the analysis based off my performance in the mm -hmm. battle. It's like, all right, cool. Everything about me says I'm an assassin. Like, I'm built for this shit. I breathe for this shit. I mm -hmm. walk for this shit. Then it's like, oh, you're a necromancer. Like, then they could be like, nah. Then be like, nigga, you sure? <laughs> like, this this the shit. Like, that's when he's like, all right, cool. Like, so I just like watching him learn more about, like, the ulterior motive that this system has. Because clearly mm -hmm. this shit wants him to get stronger mm -hmm. um, by any means necessary. Uh, or any opportunity available so it's just like oh have you like read ahead already no nah, i haven't so I haven't. why do you think the system wants them to get stronger based off the shit they say like just the shit they do and the shit they say no like, i know they want him to get stronger yeah, I'm yeah, saying, yeah, yeah why do you think that is oh um the situations they put him in when he's whenever he's faced with like a random fight or some shit no nigga like what do you mean what do you think they're getting preparing him for why do you think they're getting him stronger like what are they trying to get him to accomplish what the system? Yes. Oh, I don't know. To, I don't know. That was the question. You keep like. Not <laughs> oh, oh, I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> to Is fight it me? The, I don't know. <laughs> to fight the ants, I have no idea. I have no idea why the system's doing that. I just know that it is doing that, and like we're learning as to why that's happening. I have no idea. Like. <laughs> This Why nigga, that's happening? Do you know? This nigga's an E rank <laughs> listener, y'all. Like, <laughs> do, do you know? No, I'm oh, asking yeah, you yeah, so yeah. we can speculate. Oh <laughs> yeah, I have no, I have no idea, bro. I have no idea. <laughs> All I can say is that like the shit with the shadow powers and shit, because it could have gave him any power. Mm -hmm. It gave him like necromancy to build an army what am i building an army for so that's one mm. I, I build my army we all grow uh and then i've already got a rank that's another thing too this nigga be leveling up really fast mm. so i feel like the system be giving him all the tools he needs to mm. level up fast as fuck mm -hmm. where it's like oh you got this job change and you got like a new title in the job change from all your extra points and it's, yeah cause you, you, you definitely got to go back to that Hellgate. Oh, right. I forgot about that shit. He definitely still has the key to that. Oh, wow. That's, so that should be something to look forward to in season two, if that's going to be a season two thing. But yeah, 
he definitely does have to go back to that because mm-hmm. that fucking Cerberus kicked his ass. Like, wasn't that shit by luck? That shit was fake as hell. But shout out to my son Jin Woo, man. I'm rooting for you. Yeah, nah, Udi. You know, heal your moms. Facts, facts, facts. Yeah, even that, like with the items in the inventory, like oh, learning that I can give you something if I hold on to it. Like, mm. it's cool. It's cool. It's just watching him explore this shit. It's just like, this is like the one nigga on the planet, I guess, or in this verse who like doesn't play video games getting like the video game fucking system mm-hmm. like and it's just like oh i don't really i'm the one nigga that don't play video games so it's like to me this system is just like mad mm-hmm. foreign where it's mm-hmm. like it's literally designed like an rpg game so that's cool i like that i like that juxtaposition with the character in the setting shout out to the niggas that solo leveling doing their thing you know all right season one what are you rating it out of 10 season one out of 10 um uh, me personally i'll give it like a 8.7 Mm-hmm. Maybe nope. I'll give it a nine, a solid nine. Why not a ten? Um, I don't know. I just I don't know. Maybe call it being stubborn. Mm-hmm. Like I feel like you know it's hard to give an anime a perfect ten. What like you ever gave a show a ten? Hmm. For what, a season. For a season. Um, that's a good question. I don't know. Um, I would like big three. I would guess like maybe Wano. Oh, from One Piece, maybe I'll give it a ten. I enjoyed one a lot, um, but yeah, I don't know. That's very, that's very hard. I would say nine mm-hmm. for solo leveling, definitely. Um, the animation was od clean. Mm-hmm. The story was good. It was an interesting ass story. Mm-hmm. Um, the characters are pretty interesting as well so far. Um, it's realistic. I feel like the only thing that's different from their world and ours is like random gates started open up mm-hmm. ten years ago. So I like that aspect. I like it's more real. It's cool. What about you? What you rating it? Uh, I probably give it a nine for something that's not necessarily related to the anime, but mm. everybody having the same name is blowing my. <laughs> is that like a? I think that's like a Korean thing, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But everybody having the same name is blowing my because it's like it's fourteen people named Song, fourteen people named Sun. It's like thirteen gens, and it's like if I'm not looking at the TV, I don't know who they're talking about. Yeah. Um, but other than that, I don't really have no complaints. It's also like the first season, so it's like kind of build up. Mm-hmm. But I also feel like he be he be burning through this shit mad fast. Yeah. So it'd be like, all right. And I really feel like he don't be having no he has no, he hasn't had any real ramifications yet. But also I'm aware that they're setting up all of these ramifications and people having their eye on him and things like that. So, yeah. You know the whole him trying to keep this a secret yeah. thing. So like, I would give it a nine just off of like me tired of everybody having the same name, but we're gonna have to deal with that anyway. Yeah. So maybe they'll get a ten. How do you two. feel about the uh, the opening date? I'll be skipping it. I'm not gonna. I on. also skip it. I saw it like the first time. It's a cool song. Mm. Eh. Eh. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I hope it's better in season two. I'm tired of theme songs. I don't really care for theme. I just want to watch the show. I just want to watch the show, enjoy the show, and get on with my day. I don't want to see the theme songs no more. Um, yeah. Somebody got to somebody gotta play me a theme song, but nah, this one's fire and specifically have me listen to it. But other than that, it's like, yeah. I don't care. I just want to watch the show and just get on with my day. Yeah. I feel like One Piece sometimes go a little bit too far with their opening themes. Should be five minutes, whole song, bridge and all. But <laughs> shout out to Solo Leveling, man. I had a blast watching it. Season one, all 12 episodes. If you haven't watched it, go watch it on shit like Crunchyroll or steal it, however you do. Um, well, hey, so support support the guys, like support the yeah, animators. Yeah, don't steal. Yeah, wrong these guys. Episode one. Yeah, <laughs> it's episode one, right? Yeah, be better than, than him. me. Than him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad we can agree. Yeah, don't finish my sentence, I'm glad bro. We can agree. I'm glad we can agree. Let me do it. Hey, solo uh, D leveling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, make sure y'all subscribe to this YouTube channel. I right, we got mad other shit going on, but we That's hit. A fact. Every Friday, I right, we back with Manga and Subs. Yo, hashtag Anime Fridays. If y'all want to send us some shit on all streaming platforms, you feel me? We'll be in there checking things out. Right. I right.